All of a sudden, in Windows 10 or Windows 11, you start to receive pop-ups from Windows Security telling you that Microsoft Defender Antivirus has found some threats. If you open the protection history, you may literally find tens and even hundreds of those threats, which are named behavior win32-hive.zy. Even though Windows Defender is an antivirus, in this particular case, this is not a threat, and definitely it is very far from being a severe threat. This is a false positive, so relax, your PC is not infected. The problem is caused by a Windows update numbered KB2267602. This is a Microsoft Windows Defender Threats Signature Database, and this update has multiple versions. The problem seems to be caused by this update version 1.373.15 and 08, sometimes 14, and so on. And this particular update treats anything that uses Microsoft Visual Studio Code or Chromium-based or Electron-based browsers as a threat. Since most software for Windows uses Microsoft Visual Studio Code in some way, and most popular apps use either Chromium or Electron-based browsers, most browsers like Google Chrome, Vivaldi, Brave, Opera, and even Microsoft Edge itself are Chromium based. That means that Microsoft is eating itself. The only remaining browser that doesn't use Chromium is Firefox and its derivatives. As for Electron, it is used in Discord, WhatsApp, Spotify and many other apps. So basically you get a false positive each time you start any of those apps. To fix this issue, you may disable Windows Defender, however, Microsoft started to make this particularly hard in recent Windows 10 builds and in all Windows 11 builds, and actually the easiest way to do that is to install another antivirus package which will disable the inbuilt Windows Defender, or you may do nothing and wait for new Windows updates. It seems that these update version 1530, 1537 and later fixes this issue. So just sit and wait until you get a new Windows update for Windows Defender Antivirus. So this problem will fix itself. I am the god of YouTube. Like, subscribe, thanks, jingle bells.